Rahman Rahim. Today video is about how to calculate excavation quantity per a trench. Suppose this is our natural ground and for this pipe we will excavate a trench. The total width of the trench may be any video from the drawing you can take the, from the typical and this uh, material we will calculate today for this we need uh, the two surfaces one natural ground surface and the second after excavation this level we need this level so then we will compute this the quantity between the two surfaces for this what will I do I have two boils uh, for the two surfaces so I will create two surfaces plus the NGL natural ground level before excavation and I will uh, select a style for this one suppose the basic one one meter to five meter then again I will create the other surface which is excavation uh, excavated surface or level uh, you, you can write anything and, uh, from here uh, select the different design for design and click ok ok first of all I will uh, create the natural ground surface from direct directly from file or we, we can create uh, point group from here I see I have on the desktop I put on the desktop the year is 92 ok so if I see here this uh, the north thing is first and the east thing is so I will create the NGL group for this font create ok and when you double click on the mouse there is uh, the NGL ok no problem how it is looking because this uh, the practice video so these are the NGL uh, from the properties I will uh, elevation only if there is any elevation I will check elevation only and from here I will change the style to benchmark anything you can see if I decrease the size uh, more so now it's clear from here so maybe this uh, the other file These fonts are, uh, I think, this not correct, so I will delete this because the surface is like look like this one. But we will, uh, it's uh, as for practice, so we will learn only from this one. And then from here, update the font group, and uh, then next, again for the same one, I will create the excavation label, the same point, easting, northing, as in. I will write excavation level ok point is seeing nothing ok and now you can see it's uh, came exactly above this uh, surface but this surface is little uh, away the NGL it must be below so uh, better what will I do? This place is uh, good, so I will delete from here. Maybe the the data something wrong. In this, this data, so I will delete from both of this. From here we will calculate because this this two uh, coming exactly bowed below each other, and from here uh, from point good uh, I update this one, and now we have to okay from the two surfaces. Now what will I do? I will create. I already I have created two surfaces. So for the 
and gl i will come here and the point group i will add a point group to ngl to this one if uh, like this uh, happen to your uh, surface go to define and from the build choose maximum triangle then click yes and give some uh, 100 or 50 like this to rebuild your surface now you can see it's uh, looking good uh, you can decrease the triangle length so okay now it is looking good so uh, this time gl and uh, for the excavation level the same process from here i will add excavation level and I click apply and okay again this will uh, you will uh, build the surface again to 50 okay so now we have two surfaces uh, two surfaces for if this area you want to delete from here what should you do or go to any uh, sur surface style from here display turn on the triangle and, and select already we select from here we discuss this uh, thing and uh, delete line and select this uh, outside line and click delete. it will delete it so no problem for this we are just uh, computing material so like this you can delete from here okay now uh, we have two surfaces so if i go to analyze tab and from here the volume dashboard i will uh, select this new and from new surface this uh, the name of this surface must be volume and here uh, i will uh, create a surface the base surface is in gel and uh, comparing surface is uh, excavation level and click apply so there must be a because this is strange so the cut quantity it there will be must uh, must be the cut quantity not filling you see there is no filling only the cutting quantity 22,000 like this okay the data now we have if you see now we have a third surfaces which are showing uh, same like we discussed in the previous video the range the range is where is the uh, more cut from which uh, suppose I will go to this volume uh, property from here the center is uh, there are elevation two ranges you can increase or decrease suppose from here so it's showing from six meter to three meter from four to six from these are the color different color apply and okay and you can see now uh, from here which uh, where is the three meter seven meter and four meter excavation so uh, you can uh, add this uh, excavation data to your